Oh, hey, everyone. Hey, Peter. I'm great. We're working. And I'm going to talk about something that I'm about to work on. Um, the surf box. This is the second iteration of the surf box. And when creating projects, like, really, you got to be open for it to fail, possibly. Like, the first one I ever made for the surf box failed horribly. As you can see, there's a hole here now where our drawer used to be. That drawer broke. Um, I thought it would be a good idea. It wasn't. And also just the way to hold the fins. I did these dados, thinking, hey, it'd be cool if I could take a fin, slide it in, and there you go. But once you get multiple fins in there, it racks back and forth, and you don't really want them breaking into each other. The first one didn't work, so then went back to the drawing board. That's where this one came from. Now this one, yeah, I used nicer wood. Instead of pine, I used mahogany. I had some leftover from a project. And here, instead of having a drawer in the main storage spot, we just had a big hole, which worked. It catched everything. The drawer, you don't have to worry about that breaking. Um, only downside about this now is when things fall down to the very bottom, say like a surf key, earplugs, small piece of wax, something, it's hard to get down there into the bottom, especially with my hands. So thinking about maybe this time, Cutting this part off, not off of this box, but on the next one. Um, making some sort of relief around here, just so it slopes down and it's easier to get down to the bottom. As you can see, also the fins are designed a little differently on this box to hold them. I have some leather, like saddles almost, for the fins to rest in so they didn't knock too much into each other. It works, it works, but there's room for improvement there as well. And that's what's important about making, designing, or anything is iterations. Your first one isn't always gonna work. In fact, you know what, failure is proof that you're trying. And that's important to try. And just keep working at it. Find new problems, find new, new iterations, be creative, exercise that creative mind muscle. Um, nothing's ever gonna be perfect. And that's why there's always room for improvement. So for this next iteration of this box, which I'm going to be doing, I already have the lumber milled up. I'm going to use teak this time. Also had a little scrap of teak left over from a project. Uh, it was nice. Teak's fun to work with if you haven't ever worked with it. And this is what's great about woodworking is really you're going to fail when you woodwork. It happens. Like you might blow something out. You might miscut a joint. You might make a wrong cut instead of, you know, one piece might be shorter than the other. Well, there's your chance to actually try to be creative and make the problem work for you. Just because you run into a hurdle doesn't mean you have to stop. Um, it's, it's tough though. I know it's tough. Especially those times when you're like, I'm not creative, I don't know what to build. Uh, that's when you just, you know, start talking to people. Look around, get some inspiration, find a problem, look for, maybe not find a problem. But if you see a problem, find a solution. It's the beauty about this. Like, your first time's not always gonna work. Look, this part even broke off right here. Granted, I did just use pine and I think super glue to put this one together. But again, it was a prototype. A prototype. Meaning, I had the idea in my head. I drew it out on paper. It didn't really look that good. I'm not a great drawer. I'm better at draw building 3D, 3D models. So, that's what I built here. My first prototype, the 3D model. I liked it. I thought it was cool. And then we used it for a while. Didn't work out. Didn't work out. And that's okay, though. Because that gave me a chance to build this better box. So, iteration two. Beautiful. Love it. Smooth. Plus that. Oh, look at those grains. So, yeah. Design thinking, man. Iterations, you come up with an idea, prototype, prototype's not gonna work, so then you have to come up with a second iteration. And then you're gonna find improvements on your second iteration, and so on and so forth. And some people get, get caught into it and say, hey, that didn't work, I can't ever do this, I can't ever do this. Well, you can, everyone can, everyone is creative. You just gotta try, you gotta practice, and never give up, that's for sure. All right, everyone, have a good one.